Hi, I'm Kenny Kennard, Regional Sales Manager with Four Winds Boats, and today we're going to talk about the HD 270 RS Outboard. Hey Doyle, how's the weather back there? I'm Doyle Vanderpaul, Marketing Manager for Four Winds Boats. We're here today to talk about the HD 270. Kenda? Up here in the bow, we have an abundance of stainless steel, from the stainless steel pull-up cleats, the bow scuff plate, the grab handles, the bimini fixtures, the stainless steel rub rail. And Doyle, what's going on in the transom? We'll spend a few minutes talking about the RS from Four Winds. Available in three colors with color matched interior. Kenda? On all of the Four Winds HD models, we have an exclusive windshield. This boat has a stainless steel header and it is ordered with the optional full height windshield. Typically with the RS, it would be the standard windshield is the low profile uh, tinted windshield. And with this glass windshield, it is curved on all three dimensions. From the stern, we're going to spend a minute talking about the Stable V hull. Stable V hull is patented. The function of Stable V is it gets you on plane at lower speeds, stays on plane at lower speeds for tow sports, and provides great lateral stability in turns. Kenda, more from the bow. Okay, so in the bow area, we have a fully finished bow. It's completely wrapped in vinyl and cushions all the way around. It's also a very deep bow. As you're sitting here, you're very comfortable yet secure as all the way up to your shoulders are well contained within the seating area. Additionally, under all of the seat cushions, you have a fully finished storage. Uh, we have a rubber mat to protect any items and keep them from sliding around. You have a gas assist shock that's gonna keep the seat on the up position. And then under the very forward seat, underneath we have a non-skid so that if you're boarding the boat from the bow, you can take one step down and comfortably into the cockpit without fear of slipping. And underneath that cushion, we have another built-in, fully finished, insulated cooler. It's just gonna drain into the bilge as the ice melts. And Doyle? Coming back to the stern, Kendi, we'd like to spend a few minutes talking about the wide, full-width walk-across swim platform, which is rarity without board power. Like notice, the design of the swim platform offers very, very easy access from the dock to the bow. The swim platform also holds the covered angled deep reach ladder. Kenda? So moving to the bow platform of this boat, you have a fully finished area. If you do not order it with the swim platform mat, which is standard on the RS series, but if it were a traditional boat without it, it would have mechanical non-skid here so that you can safely board the boat and without fear of slipping. This boat is also shown with the optional transom shower and freshwater system. And here we have an optional wind list where you can raise or lower the anchor from the helm. And Doyle, back to you. Here again at the stern, standard with the RS, is our soft touch, great feeling on the feet, marine mat. We also have incorporated another great option, which would be our tripod mount Skeeto for those that are interested in water sports. Kenda, back to you. Here we've inserted the optional bow fill-in cushions to where you have comfortable seating for three adults, and it's a very deep bow, so you could even fit a few small children up in front of the adults. We have conveniently placed cup holders as eight cup holders are in this area. And Doyle, back to you. Another great feature at the transom of the HD270 RS outboard is this massive transom lounge seat. Great place to be when you're watching the kids in the water. We even have a massive underseat storage at the transom. Kenda, would you come here and give me a hand, please, so we can demonstrate this? Kenda, would you describe for me the size of this storage? <laughs> This storage is quite deep. I don't know how I'm actually gonna climb out of here. I think, Kendi, you could probably use the integrated optional large igloo cooler as your step to get out. <laughs> okay, there we go. Along with the cooler standard on the boat, something everyone needs is the bucket with design storage for your anchor. Hey Doyle, where are you? Here we have a ski locker. Well, Kenda, with a boat this big, it's got to be a huge ski locker. You need room for everything. Well, I guess. I'm going to step away and let you finish up talking about the features of the ski locker. Okay. Well, we have a fully finished ski locker. It's completely lined with finished fiberglass. 
In the bottom, you have a rubber mat that's going to prevent items from slipping around. You also have a drain that's going to drain directly into the bilge. And we have a gas shock so that the lid will stay open as you're accessing your items. Hey, Doyle, tell us about the head. Kinda, you asked me to talk about the head. In order to talk <laughs> about the head, I had to be able to make sure I fit. And you did. I'm not a small individual, as you can tell. Well fed. It's a great head compartment. Room for myself. It's got a Corian countertop, wood finish, standard sink, and a port light in the side for natural light. Also has a courtesy light inside for those that want to use it. What else would you like to tell me about? With all of the bucket seats in the Four Winds HD series, you have a standard flip-up bolster. Additionally, they all will swivel by adjustment down below. We have a great notch cut out. So that is designed in to where you can comfortably sit forward facing, yet be able to angle your body and have a leg just kind of hang over the side there and speak to the passengers in the back. In the back of the seat, you have a ventilation area. And Doyle, back to you. Back at the stern of the HD270, you notice we have a wonderful, convenient walkthrough on the starboard side. It is protected to keep your animals and small children by the stainless steel gate. And also another great feature that we've integrated is the storage in the walkthrough itself. And now back to Kenda at the helm. We have an ergonomically designed helm with a tilt steering wheel. You also have stainless steel toggle switches. Now note the end of these toggle switches light up in red when they're engaged. As you can see, we have blue courtesy lighting around the helm area. Additionally, this boat has the Merck SmartCraft gauges and the optional Simrad GPS. The stereo control at the helm is Kicker. It's AM, FM, and Bluetooth compatible. Here you have the audio inputs and USB input, as well as a 12 volt receptacle, and conveniently placed cup holders for easy access to the driver. We also have storage netting on both the port and starboard side by the bucket seats for sunglasses, etc. And Doyle, back to you. Thanks, Kenda. You know, the design of the stern of the cockpit of the HD270 is expansive. The whole area is surrounded by rich upholstery, fine detail, top stitching, different use of colors to make it a luxurious area. Also, with all the people you have on board, you always need storage. Under all of your cockpit seating on the HD270 is massive storage with WIMS or Water Intrusion Management System. The system is designed to wick water away from storage from the wet items, suits, and towels. For the port rear seat, is a nice surprise of a dedicated trash receptacle storage. And now, Kenda, back to you. And continuing into the bow, the ski locker actually continues to where we have full in-floor storage. It's fully finished, and you do have a bulkhead to prevent items from slipping between the two storage areas. Thanks, Kenda. Another great feature of the HD270 RS is a full fiberglass liner with anti-skid finish in the floor. You'll also see that the standard snap-in reed mat is another great feature. One other point of interest. These are all self-bailing cockpits. You'll see the stern mounted drains, so any water that enters the cockpit will drain overboard. The HD series is entirely made of fiberglass, so you have a fiberglass hull, a fiberglass stringer system, which provides the support and the structural integrity, as well as a fiberglass deck. A couple other real quick points. This boat is covered by the Winning Edge three-year warranty. That's a bow to stern factory sponsored warranty. Also, the boat is standard with Four Winds custom trailer. All welded, swing away tongue, lasts a lifetime, and for safety, has disc brakes on both axles. Thanks for watching, y'all.